I don't like clowns. I am clearly not a white person. I am clearly not a white man. I am a black non-binary woman. Um, so it was pretty difficult for me because a lot of people did not take me seriously when I first joined the industry, which I think is kind of crazy because I'm making a game just like everyone else, so why wouldn't you take me seriously? Like, am I, is it because I'm black? I mean, it probably is. If a white man may validate, it would be fucking everywhere. That game would be everywhere. <laughs> A little background about this. I have a team of 21 right now uh, for Validate. It's a pretty big team. It's a crazy big team for indie games. But who is your team? Validate has a team of mostly people, mostly all people of color. We have no white people on our team. Um, I did that because I wanted to create a safe environment. And I know the best way for an environment to be safe is to be around people who are just like me. Um, and I'm not saying that white people in the industry are creating safe, unsafe environments. I'm not saying that. Yes, you did. You said. I did that because I wanted to create a safe environment. That is not what I'm saying. I am saying that sometimes it is hard to work with white people because they think that something made okay, but it was really a microaggression. What do you mean made up? It's made up. I made that shit up. And no one wants to deal with that while they're trying to make a game that they love. Fill in the blank. <laughs> Imagine if you will. We're gonna take a few questions. <laughs> thank you, Brad. Thank you, Brad. Thank, 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 thank you so much. Thank you, Back in the vehicle. Back to the cars. Thank, thank you. Back to cars. Thank you, Brad. We're happy to watch Thank you, Brad. Thank you. All right, all good. Thank you. Thank you. We gotta go. Thank you. Thank you. We gotta go. Shoot. Shoot. Not allowed. Not allowed? You know, you're not allowed to see. Let's check in on the leader of the free world. Look at that confident gait. He is as <laughs> fit as a fiddle in body and mind. Four more years, no problems there. America's enemies must be terrified of this man's strength and mental faculties. You just know China, Russia, Iran are watching on, quivering in fear. You mean me little heart quiver. Mr. President, do you agree with Chuck Schumer that Netanyahu should go? Look, let's not judge too quickly. Let's see if we get an answer there to the journalist's question about whether the president supports his colleague Democrat Chuck Schumer's call for regime change in Israel. Regime change, not in Gaza, Israel. This clip should inspire supreme confidence in the commander-in-chief. Oh dear God, if that man is fit to be president, then I'm a bluefin tuna. That is a man who should be enjoying his golden years having ice cream and pudding in a retirement facility, not the White House. Couldn't agree more. Where's the kid cat? Be careful. <laughs> It is a messed up world.